Hi everybody, this is Erica, and today I'm going to be reviewing the Simply Ageless um, Skin per Skin Perfection Essence by CoverGirl. This is like a new product, and it's getting a lot of hype because it's said to be a dupe for a Chanel product that's very similar. Um, it is basically like a serum kind of foundation. I wouldn't even call it a foundation, I'd call it like a skin tint at most. Um, I've had it for a few days and I've tried it, um, so this won't be like a first reaction, but um, I did go on the website and just kind of find out what skincare ingredients they have. And they have something called tranexamic acid. Now tranexamic acid is for um, evening the complexion of the skin tone, so like dark spots and things like that, it will, it will target that. It also has bokuchi oil, which is um, said to be like a plant-derived uh, version of like a retinoid. Um, it's not really like a proven skincare product, but um, they did put it in this and then it's said to be 70% water. So the one thing that I can say, like when I apply it, is there's maybe a learning curve on this product a little bit, but it feels literally like you're just rubbing water on your face. It doesn't even feel like serum. Um, <clears throat> so I just kind of will shake the bottle. I don't know if that's really making a difference, but these are microencapsulated beads of pigment. So the pigment is going to basically disperse as you're spraying it onto your face. Um, so I'm just going to take this amount and rub it all over face and the only thing I have underneath this is a uh, sunscreen And you can't really feel the beads as you're dispersing the product, but um, that is the product up close. So I find it can be a little bit messy to work with, and you do have to really like kind of blend. Now I like to actually wear this kind of like a primer. Um, so that's it with the product on and that's it without. So it does provide some coverage. It's minimal coverage, but does provide some coverage. And I'm just gonna put it on the rest of my face. So when I use it as a primer, I do find that my skin looks more plumped. Um, it's, I like covering it with um, the Maybelline skin tint and I get more coverage out of it and I just feel like my, my skin looks better. Now I'm kind of surprised that kind of the main ingredient in this product is water. Um, it's not a cheap foundation. I think it's like around $20, which for the drugstore is pricey. Um, but it's when you compare it to the Chanel product, it's pretty affordable. So that's it with the product on. Got a little my hair. So definitely like kind of a radiant, a little bit like of like a filtered quality to the skin. Um, don't expect much coverage from this product. But um, so tranexamic acid, as I said, is meant to 
reduce sunspots and hyperpigmentation. And the Bakuchi oil is for, um, kind of like, is, is used as like a retinoid, um, just basically, um, you know, a substitute for retinol. So I, would I buy it again? <clears throat> I don't think so. Um, I was able to get my hands on it pretty easily because, um, I live in a retirement community and I don't think a lot of the people that live in the area watch like, um, TikTok or anything like that. So, um, I, it was definitely stocked up at my local CVS and I was able to pick it up, but I heard people have to like order it online right now. So, um, that's just the finished product. I hope you guys have a great day and I'll talk to you later. Bye.